And Jordan Sayopa, live in West Ashley. Jordan, you were at one of several locations where people still have one day left to participate in early voting. Brendan, just one day left, but early voting numbers are already breaking records this year. Now, I spoke with some people who placed their vote here at Seacoast today. They say that the lines are moving fast and they're eager to have their voices heard. I wanted to skip the lines and uh, it worked out well for me. Leroy Smalls Jr. and 51,000 others in Charleston County have already voted in the 2022 general election. The Charleston County Board of Elections predicts that number will grow to more than 60,000 by the time early voting ends on Saturday. This is huge. I mean, Charleston County, we're not the highest registered voter total in, in the state but we lead the state in early voting and absentee voting. Those who live in Charleston County have seven early voting locations to choose from. Officials believe this is part of the reason they're seeing record-breaking numbers this year. Another factor, the convenience. I think we waited less than 10 minutes. The poll workers today have been wonderful, very efficient, and very professional. It's believed early voting will account for more than half of the vote this election, making for less crowded polling locations on Tuesday. Voters are going to see on election day shorter lines um, because most of those voters have already cast ballots. And the candidates themselves are also participating. Representative Nancy Mace and Dr. Annie Andrews, both vying for the first congressional district seat, were seen casting their votes ahead of November 8th. Early voters eager to have a say in the issues that matter most to them. I'm concerned about democracy. I'm, I'm concerned about women's right to health care. And uh, I want to do anything I can to support you know, reason. And officials predict this year's early voting numbers will be more than double what they were in 2018, which was the last midterm election. Reporting live in West Ashley, Jordan Sayopa, Count on Two.